Hey guys, um, so we're here in Greensboro today doing some toy hunting. Uh, get ready to go to our first target. Any comments? Uh, I just hope we actually find something. You found some stuff earlier today. And, um, Shh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we'll put that in a new video. But yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, uh, I did some toy in Ashboro and uh, I'll show that off soon. Yeah, so hopefully we find something, guys. And, you know, a lot of these places have been kind of dry lately just yeah. in general i mean i but you get on the tour but this has been like this for the past year or so where there's just nothing on the toy aisles um so hopefully we find something or a covid slow down production or something like that i don't know yeah i know i'm looking for uh galvatron i think I'm... the beast wars yeah the Gal okay. kingdom yeah the kingdom yeah so i'm looking for that and some of the new ones are supposed to come out so I don't know. We'll go in there and see what's up. All right. See y'all inside. All right, guys. So down the toy aisle and I don't know who out here. Yeah. You see the Megatron? Yeah, two of those. Um, it's like the same old Beast Universe stuff. Same stuff. The Shane Chi, they can't get rid of, it seems like. Wrestling. I know this one looked cool. I'm not into them, but the Angel Garcia. Oh, yeah. And yeah, Nick just... Cole. We're saying there's just not really a lot on the shelves. They made the turtles over here, like the frogs. They got those again? Yeah, there's like three of them down there. Oh, hey, maybe they had to make room for something good over there, so they had to move these here. Breaking news. <laughs> Breaking news. <laughs> it's got to be it. Yeah. Ain't nothing at the Jurassic Park. There's like kid playing with it. I got a feeling I think that's why. It's like, get them frogs out of here. <laughs> so that's where we're going next. See you there. All right, yes, yeah, so we're walking up. Looks about the same. Yeah, bad news. I got the Gorilla Girl out of here. I do like that one. There's like a silver one. Like that. Was it more rare or something? Yeah. I seen like someone found it at Walmart. Um, I don't really have that stuff. God, I still kind of want that King Kong. Dude. What you gonna do with it? Oh, it's Jaws. It's Quint. I mean, it ain't Jaws, but. From the Next movie. best thing. It's from the movie, Jaws. So that's cool. Quint. Oh, yeah, I wonder if they're gonna make more of these dudes that so just. It's like you got a gun, a couple beers, about all you need. <laughs> uh. That looks fancy. What is that? It's like our series. Ours has a case with it too. Hmm. There's another one there too. I think this is where maybe the frogs went here. I guess whoever stocked them didn't really know yeah. where they went and just put them there. I don't even see a tag for them to be honest with you. Bob Ross back there. Uh, so yeah, I guess that's it for this target. We'll probably go to another one. Dude, actually, that looks kind of cool. Well, not that, but this. It's like a robot Hulk. Hmm. Yeah, that's kind of neat. Anyways, we're on to the next one. All right, guys. So we're here at another Target. We're in New Garden. So I'm gonna find something cool. So looking for Galvatron and. I'm I'm looking for a really nice uh, uh, CRT television. <laughs> Target. <laughs> yeah, we'll find it. Yeah, I wish that I wish they still sold that stuff. Yeah, me too. Yeah. All right, see you inside. Well, we're down to the aisle and still no Galvatrons. I guess it was down here at some point. Nice. They do look good. They do look. Have you seen these? A small Megatron. What is that one? Um, is it a green turkey. Uh, turkey skeleton. Dracodon. Dracodon. They have that one in green and they have that one in black. Vertebrae. There's a star too. Have you seen these? Yeah. Some of the small versions of them. Oh, I Have you seen this star screen? Yeah. That's cool. from the Bowling Bee movie. So we got Trono, Dinobot. Still want that Dinobot kind of. Um, DC 
these stuff. You ain't, you ain't started that collection, have you? No, kind of got burned on the one I bought. I bought like a uh, anime series Batman. He had real skinny legs and not stand. I know which one you're talking about, but he did, he's got skinny legs anyways, right? And he had like one of those little pads too. He stands on them. It's weird. Ugh, I still like the Iron Man, but I don't, know, I don't feel like paying 20 bucks for it. I like the colors on it. Okay, this is supposed to be another side. Let's see what they got. Shang Chi Dragon. I wonder that's supposed to be Fing Fing Fing. Sometimes they just create stuff that's not even in the movie just to sell. Like the kids' toys. This side, the wrestlers. Hey, you know, give this whole Rio. Yeah, they always have her. You know, you know, if you head down the line, this is the one that's going to be worth a lot of money because it seems like every time there's a um, one that stays on the shelf, they don't manufacture as many and they end up being the most valuable. Yeah, that's true. Get it. No, you get it. I don't want it. <laughs> Got the, it looks like Luke King Stormtrooper. I didn't watch that show yet, but I heard it's okay. Well, I feel like these are starting to pick up in sales. I see these, uh, like, I wonder if that's still fifteen dollars because that was on sale. I think one to Raleigh or whatever. I don't see anything else really. Let's see what's on the rest of part stuff. Let's see the Brachiosaurus horse. It's really cool one. I guess this is more the collector stuff, the, um, the Amber collection. Oh, okay. Makes sense now. I mean, because what kids, they, they have a Jeff Goldblum, that whole kid would buy that. Yeah. That's, that's kind of neat. Alright, I guess we'll go to the collection I own. See you there. Sorry. Are y'all recording? Um, not a whole lot. It's like some new stuff, nothing. Fancy. Like the Iron Maiden ones. Brian Frankenstein. Stan the Opera. Stan Lee. You got these guys. Yeah, it's one I never bought. I try Ceratops things on a lot of space with his tail. No, I don't like them though, but. And they look really cool though. Yeah. I don't see how the frogs. Aren't selling as good as they are because they look. I wish they did all four of them. Maybe that's one of them. Like a phantom. I kind of remember that TV show. Uh, I, don't know. I don't see anything else, to be honest with you. Yeah. Alright, well, I guess we'll go to another Target. See you there. Alright, guys, so we're at our final Target and we got like a Shane Chi end cap, so getting ready for the movie in September. Is that when it comes out? I think so. Okay. Are you interested in it? Because I didn't think it looked all that great, honestly. I don't see anything so either. I mean, I could be surprised. Well, the snake eyes look really good, but... Um, about the same for DC. This is new. What is it? Power Rangers? Look at the Blue Ranger. Billy. Oh, they don't... It's someone else. But it is a Blue Ranger. It must be from... The Lightning Collection, I guess that's not from the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. It's the only ones I really know. My very first group. Um, more Ching Chi and more Tiger. Um, come on, man. That's how it's all just somewhere. Yeah. You just gotta be a DJ. Hey. We asked for it. <laughs> well, yeah. That's actually, that's actually not a good figure. <laughs> well, I mean, I think this Ray Ripley looks pretty good, actually. It does look really good. She's actually, uh, I like watching her. Oh, that, to it's a terrible face, man. Look at this. It's like really bored. Yeah. Like, if you look at that compared to that with. Yeah, that's a lot better, I think. Yeah. A lot more detail on the face. Oh, 
kind of like this edge. Well, never mind. His face looks a little funny. He's bad. Yeah, I was looking at it earlier. China. I don't know. Might be worth it. Just get that pump it. Anyway, do something funny with it. There's a lot of these orchards of evil or rise of evil. Yeah, I know. I thought that was rare until I see now I see it everywhere. I did too. That was the first one I bought. Still really cool though. Let's see. Warhammer collection. Dr. Ian Alcum. Alcum. Yeah. Alright, I guess we'll go to the collection aisle and see what they got over there. See there? Especially around the corner, we've seen these. I've seen, heard of them coming out. God, all the packages are bent up. One, though, Skeleton God. <laughs> these look pretty good, actually. Looking at the back. I've seen that moss man, he's like more like a swamp creature now. Mm -hmm. I like the skeletal a lot, this kind of he man. But those would be pretty cool. I'd like to see the rest of them. And... Yeah, I don't think I'm sold on this one, but I like it there. All right, on to the collection. Uh, uh. All right, so we're the collection now, and I see the Baxter. Yeah, that's I've a good... got this one though, but like it's, it's really neat. I'm surprised that one don't fall off the shelves. Like, I got to get the package too, and it looks amazing. <clears throat> uh, yeah, this one looks, it's a phenomenal set here. The Splinter, it's just a really good set. So I got more frogs. Kind of surprised that doesn't sell out too. Maybe they're just producing more now. Maybe there's a. Yeah. I've seen these on Wild Team Fortress too. I'm not into that, but like that's. Kramer. Uh, I like the box, I guess. Oh, Cause with it. For the Kramer. And. It is Halloween too. You see oh. this little Stan Lee minifigure? Uh, Michael Myers. Oh, that's kind of neat. Yeah. I see they got some uh, rock steadies and B bops. I think it looks cross eyed. Yeah. You can see that, yeah. That. Cool. I like it though. It's bigger. I mean, it's just it's not really. Yeah, uh, future duck. Yeah, well, that's about it for targets. I actually did stop at a game stop before here and found something really cool, but it's raining too much outside and it's too crowded in there to record, so we will show you that too. Yep, it's gonna be big, good news. Yeah, it's pretty big. Bye. All right, so this is probably our last stop. We have found a Walmart across the street and good God, this is barren. Like, not much at all. Same old He-Man figures we've always seen. Skeletor and Either get Skeletor or He-Man or Skeletor or He-Man. Eh, I have seen one of those in a while, but it's not a go to here. Shane and Cheese. They have the, uh... Oh, the villain wave. Huh? Got two Dooms, a uh, Hood, a uh, Arcade. I forgot this wave, actually. It's, I really like it. Build figure's pretty cool, too. Still want that Dinobot kind of. Nothing up top. I guess they got a collection. I guess we'll go there too and see what they got. This uh, is very, very bare though. Yeah, I've been this one a long time. I remember being kind of bad. I've seen the Castle of Race Goals a couple of times. Like, I sent that to you. I sent a picture of that to you. Actually, I found it at Ashboro Walmart. Yeah, actually, with the next saying, I didn't get it though, but then I went again. You seen it? Yeah. Yeah. It's gone. I don't know where I put it though, but it's awesome. Uh, I don't see it anywhere. Here's a remnant of the collection aisle. Found the gizmo. He's in the wrong spot though. Man. Alright, we'll go there. See you there. Alright, so we got a little too fast, but seeing this, this is uh the ten dollar one, this is Kingdom. It actually has a tape inside. I can really tell, but I remember that little two pack of tape that uh <laughs> Yeah, so that was cool. Alright, see you the collection aisle. All right, guys, so I just want to show a video of all I got today. Um, so those AEW figures I got at uh, Toy Busters in Ashboro. They're a great place to, like, go and really trade. has good deals and everything like that. So I got Pentagon Jr., got Dustin Rhodes, and these Matt Jackson and Nick Jackson and the Young Bucks. I also found this at that um, GameStop I was talking about. But 
Show the back of it. I was real excited to find this. But yeah, that's her finds for the day. All right. See y'all later. Bye.